So I'm Hikma Hamza, a proud student of Apam Senior High School and I'm currently in my second year. My name is Edwin Engman and I'm from Ghana Christian International High School and I'm in year 11. I'm Rama Zakaria Sedik from Every Girl Senior High School and I'm in Form 2. My name is Nikopo Dankwa and I school at Ascendant Senior High School in the Central Region and also I am in my second year. This morning, we started with a recap from yesterday. So we're learning CAD, which is computer-aided design. And then in engineering, engineers, they, they use a software to mold something before they bring it to life to, to see the function it can perform. So we, we were divided into groups, and then each group was given a car part to mold or to create. Then we assembled, oh, and then we had a very nice car. All right, so today I learned the various things that come into play when it has to do with theater production. And then we also learned cultural intelligence. We learned certain things about cultural intelligence. We learned cultural appropriation, cultural assimilation. And then we viewed so many things on Twitter, so many things on social media, which has to do with what we learned. And then the fashion design, I learned how to like dye shirts and dye other materials. We also learned how to make like bracelet like chains. We also learned how to like do paint and various aspects there. I believe all of you will love. With the MBC, that the business model canvas. It describes the rationale of how an organization creates, um, delivers, and also captures values. And then the MVPs, we dealt with it by making Asabia one of our coaches talk about her, her entrepreneurial business. But her speech, you could tell that there were um, key activities, key partners, the channels. Um, the research scheme and also cost, uh, cost structures and so far so good the day ended to be an interesting one and I just can't wait to have more fun. We were learning about sensors and today we treated um, only we talked about only two sensors which was the ultrasonic sensors and the color sensors. So the ultrasonic sensors um, what it really does is it measure distance between your robot and then the obstacle yeah and also the color sensors also it detects colors and then um, prints it on your robot yeah that's what and then we also had a mini challenge we were to program our robot to move in certain directions in grid lines yeah 